Good morning, this is Mayor Valensky with Driving Markets. Driving while talking about markets. Let's kick off. CPI, PPI came out. So the CPI is the Consumer Price Index in the US. Retail price inflation came in higher than expected. On this channel, we've been stating over and over again, looks like inflation has bottomed out and is on the rise. PPI, Producer Price Index, which is inflation at the manufacturing level, also came out higher than expected. So core came out higher than expected, but a headline more or less managed or, li or lived up to the expectations of the analysts on Wall Street. Now, with that, you've also got oil ticking up to $93 a barrel. We stated over and over again that it's $72 a barrel. Oil is going up. It's now $93 a barrel. All of those are ingredients of, or that is an ingredient of inflation. You've got housing costs have gone up, and petrol or oil has gone up. Those are two major ingredients, and you can expect inflation to continue ticking up. However, when the news came out, equity markets have discounted or disregarded the news. Why is that? They believe that the Fed is onto a soft landing. They believe the Fed has it right when it comes to inflation and interest rates, and they're not going to raise interest rates going forward, and therefore the market shot up. The Dow shot up, the S&P, the Nasdaq, all of the tech stocks shot up. The UK went up 2%. Europe was up. Everything was up. Even Bitcoin was up. All was up, and no one seems to be paying attention to the fundamentals that are feeding into inflation. So inflation is going to tick up. And when the market wakes up and starts strolling through, stops strolling through the park thinking everything's rosy and hunky-dory, they're going to come to a full stop and go down. But at the moment, looks like the momentum is up. The bulls have the market by the horns, and it looks like they want to push it even higher before it will turn around. So those of you who are shortest of bears, got to have a lot of patience. You've got to trade small with a lot of money in your account to ride out the storm. Those of you who are bulls are obviously extremely happy and pushing the market higher. Whichever way you are, remember, markets always will move in one direction or the other, and you never get it right all of the time. If you get it right some of the time, you're doing very well. Don't forget to subscribe, to share, to comment. You can see my book on Amazon. This is May Valensky with Driving Markets, driving while talking about markets. Have a good day.